Yeah, I'm in game mode. I got my game face. I'm ready to kill it. Cooking up everything inside skill. Yeah, toy, toy, three, zero. I'm gonna go off and kill some more shit. Even if it's a little bit more, but I don't give a fuck. I'm in game mode. Yeah, this is my game mode. I'm gonna explode like a grenade for Call of Duty. I'm gonna explode like a grenade for Call of Duty. I'm gonna talk my shit out like the guns for high life. Yeah, I'm gonna beat the shit out of the bosses like I'm a bad mutant. I muted my crap so much over the years. I'm not the same. Yeah, chameleon. Yeah, I gotta go build a crap some shit in Minecraft. Yeah, I'm gonna bot that shit. Bitch, I'm in game mode. Watch it explode this shit. I'm gonna implode with the sickness. Yeah, I'm a victory of greatness. I'm in game mode. Game mode. Yeah, it's that game mode. Yeah, bitch, that game mode. Great ever do it like this what the fuck is up everybody this your motherfucker seen chris bray back in another video we're back in this bitch we're about to do yeah another episode of minecraft modded beyond wild yes i finally fixed the mod pack i got a new download link um which will be in the description so you guys can download it um so basically i figured out what was going on with the mod pack so there's a mod called industrial light and it quit working, so I had to remove it. But also, um, this 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 uh not only not only affects the mod pack in a big way, but it also does it in a positive way too. Um, not just negative way, but also a positive way too. So while we got rid of Industrial Light, um, I updated the Thermal Expansion mod. Um, I think it's called the Thermal Series or whatever. Um, and I updated those mods, and apparently the newer version of it adds in a fluid duct pipe now it's called a let me look it up it's called a fluid yeah it's called a fluid duct uh, pipe and basically we can make this now so yeah losing losing the the yeah we lost one mod but this mod was updated so that way we can actually now uh use our magmatic dynamo with our sky uh stone tank that we made here so we're not really compromising a whole lot but we are going to lose a lot of so we lost a lot of ores um as you all saw we had a lot of good ores and everything we lost a bunch of that because of the mod um but hey it is what it is it, it is what it is the series will go on um but it won't have industrial light in it because uh i couldn't figure out how to get it to work it was not working with the mod pack so i had to get rid of it i had to remove it um i'm guessing i'm guessing it's because the mod just hasn't been updated or maybe the mod developer decided not to even uh update it at all or i don't know what the hell is going on with it but that being said um it is what it is it is what it is it's sad i know yeah 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 it is, it's, it's a little bit sad but um it is what it is it is what it is so i'm gonna see if we have any lead um or i don't think we need lead for this i think all we need is copper or no we need bronze that's right that's right we need bronze okay so i'm gonna jump right into this so we're gonna get right on into the mod pack so we need to have copper dust which in order to get copper dust um all we got to do is pulverize uh, some of this down so we're gonna pulverize some of that down um and make copper dust and then we got to make bronze so we got to make bronze and then we also need to get some glass okay so bronze and glass is all we need to make a fluid duct and then we can actually make it and i think there's a couple other items we got to create for before we actually can be able to use this in order for us to actually uh you know you guys you guys understand so yeah let's go ahead and pick up the magmatic dynamo um for now that way we can uh because I, I think I'm going to move this. I think I'm going to move this somewhere else. I think I'm going to move it. Instead of just putting it right there, I think I'm going to put it um, right next to... Uh, not not next to the other one, but I think I'm going to put it... I think I'm going to put it right here. Yeah, I think I'm going to put it like right there. That looks pretty good. Yeah, and, th and then we can put the Magmatic Dynamo um, on top of this. Or actually, no, 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 no. Okay, I'm going to I'm gonna actually going to move this again. Um, Where do I actually want to put this? Um, let's see. I think I'm gonna put it over here. I think I'm gonna put it like maybe I guess I could put it right here Um, yeah, let's put it right here. Th this is a good little spot for it. Um And put the lava in there. There we go. Just gotta make sure you don't right click it on the floor because I'll burn it'll burn all that down actually um Yeah, there's we could put it anywhere just about We could put it just about anywhere, but I think I am going to put it I think we should put it right here. I think we should put it right here. Yeah, this would be nice. And then we can kind of, uh, yeah, there we go. That looks pretty good. So yeah, we'll just put it right here. We'll put it right there for now, um, until I can figure out another another spot for it. But uh, for the meantime, let's go ahead and uh, let's 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 uh, smell some glass. So we're gonna need to have, uh, I think it I think it needs any type of glass really, or maybe I need to make hardened glass. Let's see. Um, how do I make hardened glass? Okay, so. 
Hardened glass is made with nether quartz, black sand, and a fire charge. A fire charge is made by coal, gunpowder, and blaze powder. Which I don't think I even have any blaze powder, do I? I don't think I do. Uh, I don't know. I'm not seeing any. I am not seeing any. Okay, that is... Oh, that is not good. Okay, I don't know if... I, I honestly don't know. Um... Yeah, I don't have any blaze powder, so I don't know. I'm gonna have to go uh, back to the nether probably and kill some blazes, maybe. I don't know. Um, but all I do know is we do need to make this uh, fluid dive. But before we do that, let's go ahead and get the uh, let's get the copper blend uh, or the bronze blend made. So in order to make bronze, we need to uh, yeah, let's see. Okay, so to make bronze. We have to make uh, bronze blend, which we need tin dust, which I can make tin dust because we have raw tin. And that is good. So let's go ahead and uh, let's go ahead and turn that into uh, uh, tin dust, and then we can actually make uh, some of this bronze, and then we can actually make the fluid ducts and everything. And actually, we don't really need the opaque one. We don't really need the windowed one. Um, it would look cool though. But I think I think we should I think we should just go with the the lead one. I think um, depending on if we have lead, I don't know if we do. Um, because, yeah, like I said, a lot of the ores that were in here got deleted because of me getting rid of the industrial light. And I know a lot of people are going to be like, why did you delete that? Well, there's no other way I could have done it. There's no other way I could have fixed the mod pack. Like, what, what, what else could I have done? Like, what else could I have done to fix this fucking mod pack in instead of deleting at least one mod? Like, explain that shit to me. <laughs> Fucking A, dude. Like, it's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. I know... I don't know why some of these people put these mods out, and then when somebody like me comes along and tries to use that mod, use that said mod, um, we're not even able to use it because fucking one person decides, oh, oh yeah, we're, we're gonna, we're gonna put out a mod, but we're going to make it to where it doesn't even work. And uh, then they put it out and then everybody downloads it thinking that they can fucking use it and then next thing you know They can't fucking use it <laughs> Like yeah, it's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. It's like why can't these mod developers Develop a mod that doesn't have any issues with it. Like it's not that it's not that hard to do It's not that hard to do um, But I guess for some people it is because either some people are incompetent or maybe some people just don't understand how it is when it comes to mod creating and everything. Um, and I've created, I've messed around creating a few mods in the past and everything. Um, but yeah, it's like, it's ridiculous how some people are. Some people are literally incompetent. So maybe that's what it is. Maybe that's what it is. Incompetent mod creators. I don't know. Um. But it is what it is. It is what it is. So I'm going to go ahead and put that there. Um, I think there's also a wrench I can make on here too. Because I know that thing keeps fucking flipping around. So let's see. Uh, it's called a wrench. Or it's called a uh, crescent. I think it's called a crescent hammer. Yeah, that's what it's called. Okay, so yeah, it is called a crescent hammer. Um, and it's made just by iron. Okay, that's pretty simple. That's pretty simple to do. It's pretty simple to do. Um... But I don't think I want it here. I don't think I want this right here, though. Um, now that I'm thinking about it, because it doesn't look—it doesn't look that great over there. It does not look that great over there. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw that up in there. I'm gonna throw the bricks up in there. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and move this again. Um, but yeah, I'm glad. I'm glad they updated this mod, though. I'm glad they did, because now I'm actually able to uh, work with machines and everything. So I think I'm gonna put this machine over here. Um, I think I'm gonna put it right over here. Yeah, I'm gonna put it right here. Um, yeah, and as long as I don't put lava on the floor, we should be fine. So, that being said, let's go ahead and do that. There we go. And let's put the, uh, magmatic dynamo. Let's put that on top of here, just like so. If I can even fucking place it down, it's not even wanting me to place it down. Okay, let's place it down there. And then I'm going to make a crescent hammer so I can flip it around because I, I don't know if I'm going to need it. But I probably will need it. Who knows? Who knows? So let's go ahead and make one. So let's do this. Okay, so there we go. We're going to make a iron gear. And let's go ahead and smelt down some of this iron. That way I get a little bit extra iron because I don't know how much iron I'm actually going to need for this uh, crescent hammer. So yeah, I just need uh, 
yeah, Iron Gear, and then I need, uh, yeah, so, I mean, this mod, this mod's pretty cool, though, the thermal, the thermal expansion and the thermal series mod, um, it's, it's pretty cool, it's pretty cool, so, yeah, there we go, nice, we got a Crescent Hammer, so I think that's about it, maybe, I don't know, um, yeah, we need a Crescent Hammer, and then let's see, what else do we need, I think we need another thing, too, I think we need a Servo, I'm pretty sure, um, Servo, let me look it up, um, Okay, so we need to make an attachment servo. In order to make an attachment servo, we need glass, redstone, and ten nuggets, which we literally have all that shit. So we should be able to do this pretty simple. There we go. Let's go ahead and take that, put that into ten nuggets. There we go. And then I think we have everything right there, maybe. Let's see. Um, let's see. Oh yeah, we're all all we're missing is iron. <laughs> Duh doy fucking there we go. Nice, we got this shit. There we go. Nice. Okay, we're gonna make two of those. I think we're just gonna make two of them. We're not gonna make any more. Um, because we only need like two. I think we only need like one or two of these. So there we go. Let's go ahead and put that there. There we go. And then, boom. There we go. Now we have we have lava power now, baby. There we go. We got that shit right right off the jump right there. Um, that is good. <laughs> that is good. I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad I took out that that uh other mod. I know it sucks a little bit, but Hey, it is what it is. It is what it is. Some mods don't work. Some mods don't work with the with each other, but it is what it is. So, um, yeah, let me see. I think I, I think I know what the machine. I think I made the machine that. Uh, did I make the machine that I that I was trying to make? I think I did. Oh yeah, the rest don't burn. That's what we were powering with this. Okay, my, fucking. It's been a minute since we played this. Um, but yeah, I'm glad I fixed the mod pack though. I'm glad I got it all figured out and everything and if you guys want to play this go ahead and uh, do so and if you guys run into any issues whatsoever let me know because if there's any more issues with the mod pack let me know and I will try my best to fix them as 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 quickly as possible as quickly and as efficiently as possible so now we need to make a flux duct okay um in, in order to make a flux duct we need uh, uh lead we need uh what are, why was I about to say tin I don't need, to. dude. Okay, we need, we need, we need to. Okay, so we need to put in some lead ingots. There we go. Um. All right. So yeah, let's go ahead and make, let's make some flux ducts, cause yeah, these are gonna hook up all of our machines to it, and then we can quit using coal for our power. Um. Cause yeah, we we're using coal power source, which is not too bad. It's not too bad. But do we really want to keep using that throughout the whole series? Hell nah. <laughs> Um, let me see, is there, hold on, I think I have all, yeah, I have everything I need to make this, okay, there we go, nice, okay, so we got flux ducts, um, which they're pretty easy to make, they're pretty easy to make, so they kind of, uh, brought back the classical, uh, thermal expansion on here, so, which I, which I, which I like, I, I fucks with it, I fucks with it, so, yeah, there we go, okay, so we're gonna go ahead, and, uh, we're gonna put the rest on furnace, I guess, right here. Um, and then just kind of, uh, do it like this. There we go. And then we're gonna put all of our machines kind of on a tree just like this. We're, this is gonna be like our little machine tree right here. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go ahead and do that. And let's go ahead and take out our pulverizer. Um, because we don't really need, we don't really need, uh, yeah, we don't really need it right there anymore. So we can, we can just hook this shit up right over here. Um, but the only, yeah, let's go ahead and put the pulverizer, I guess, right there. That looks pretty good. Okay, so we got the rest of furnace there. We got the pulverizer. Um, there's a few other machines we do got to make. Um, but I don't know if we're going to be able to make them this episode, but we are going to, uh, dive into them as the more, as the more episodes, uh, progress and everything. Um, and for the Sterling Dynamo, I'm going to go ahead and take this out because we don't really need that anymore. Um, we can conserve space in here, so... Yeah, there we go. So now we got all that kind of set up. Um, we got we got 54 10 dust, which is pretty good. Um, so yeah, it looks like we got everything in order. Um, the only thing we gotta do now is we gotta we gotta go to the we gotta go back to the Nether and we gotta fill up our lava tank. So if we don't if we don't keep this lava tank filled up, um, then it won't it won't power our machines, and that's why we need to have uh, lava at all times. So that being said, I'm gonna go to. Uh, we're, we are going to the portal runes. Here we go. Let's go. Let's go back over there and uh, Let's see if we let's see if we can uh, Let's see if we can go into the nether um, Okay, there we go. Nice. Okay. We're gonna go back to 
Uh, let's do, uh, let's call, let's go back to the lava hole. Let's get some more, uh, lava. There we go. Um, we're gonna get a few buckets of this. Let's go back to, uh, let's go to portal back. There we go. And let's go ahead and fill this, because, yeah, we gotta fill this up in order for us to actually have lava, so that way we can continue powering our machines and everything. So, that being said, let's go ahead and go back to the treehouse. There we go. Um, nice. Okay, so, yeah, we got all of our lava power going. Um... Yeah, it's taking it out at a pretty, pretty good rate. Like, look at that, dude. We already, we already got a little bit of uh, lava in there, so that's good. Um, yeah, actually, I should make some more buckets. That way, we can actually uh, hold more lava in it. That's, that's what I was thinking of doing. Okay, there we go. Um, let's get like three, bu three more buckets of lava. That should be, that should be enough. That should be enough um, to do this. So let's go ahead and go back to the portal runes. There we go. Um, so yeah, we got three buckets right here. Let's go ahead and fill those up with lava and then we will have pretty much infinite <laughs> lava power for now. For now, I'm saying for now, but yeah. I'll figure out a way to get lava another, I'll find another method to get lava out of the nether. Um, there's gotta be another method on here, but until I find that method, this is gonna be our little bit of a method type thing. Um, I might actually have to do this in between episodes, but it is what it is. It's not, it's not too much of a hassle anyway, just me going going into the portal and back and teleporting back to the base and everything. So it's not too bad. It's not too bad. I ain't complaining one bit. I ain't complaining one bit, fella. <laughs> I ain't complaining one bit. Let's get this shot. Okay, let's go to the home treehouse. There we go. Um, let's fill this up with lava. Here we go. There we go. Nice. There we go. So yeah, we just fucking filled that shit up. Now, now, let's go ahead and start filling up the actual tank itself. So, let's go to, uh, let's go back to the portal runes. There we go. Let's teleport back there. Um, let's get some more lava. Just, that way we can kind of cap it off a little bit. Um, that way we have enough in there. So, now we have, we filled up the, the magmatic dynamo. But, we still gotta, we still gotta have, uh, we still gotta have lava in order for us to actually, um, you know, have, have actual lava storage. So, we are going to go ahead and do that. There we go. There we go. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. Then we're going to go back to the portal. There we go. Nice. Um, so, yeah. This is pretty good. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm glad I fixed this mod pack, though. I'm fucking glad I fixed this mod pack. You guys don't even know. I was panicking. I was literally about to panic about this mod pack. I, th I thought we were going to have to cancel the series. I was like, oh, my God. I didn't know what's going on with this. It's not It's not working. <laughs> But at least I figured it out. Now I know exactly what I need to do for it. So, uh, yeah, it looks and it looks like this thing kind of pretty much uh, takes out. Uh, yeah, it looks like it takes out the lava just automatically. So that's good. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to have to figure out a way to get uh, more lava into it um, until I figure that out. I'm going to keep it, I guess, like this. Um, I mean, it, I mean, it, it, it'll work. It'll work for now. It'll work for now. So that's good. At least everything's powered up now. So that's good. Um, so at least we got a steady power source going now. So we got uh, lava power going. Um, let's see what else. Um, yeah, I guess we can. I guess we can make another machine. You guys want to make another machine? Let's see. Um, let's go to at thermal. All right. So there's a few other machines we can make on here. Um, but I don't know which, oh, let's see, magma crucible, I know that's one of them that we, that we do need to make, um, induction smelter, pulverizer, okay, I think one of the, I think, I think we do gotta make an induction smelter, I think that's another one we do gotta make, um, so I don't know if, uh, yeah, Infar. so yeah, Induction smelter. Okay, so I think we do need to make an induction smelter and a magma crucible. And then also, I think there's another one that we had to make. I don't know. Uh, it's called a fluid encapsulator. Is that what it's called? So yeah, they did, they did kind of change the names a little bit. So yeah, we do need to make a fluid encapsulator and a magma crucible. So I'm going to go ahead and make those. Might as well. Um, because you never know if we're going to need them or not. So let's go ahead and do that. Um... So pretty, pretty simple recipes. Okay, let's go ahead and do this. Hold on. I need to see if I have more redstone. Yes, I do. Nicely, nice. Um, nicely done. There we go. Nice. At least it did delete all my ores. I'm, I'm, I'm happy that it didn't get rid of all my ores. Um, but it did, you know, you, you guys get what I mean. You guys get what I mean. So 
Yeah, I'm glad, I'm glad I didn't get rid of all my ores. At least I kept a good amount of them. So, I mean, I at least I didn't lose a whole lot. At least I didn't lose a fuck ton of shit. But, hey, it is what it is. Um, So, yeah, let's go ahead and make some copper gears. Which, in order to make copper gears, we need uh, iron nuggets. And then we surround it with uh, raw copper, which is pretty simple to do. Let's see. Uh, Where is the copper? There it is. Okay. Um, All right, let's go ahead and do that. Let's smelt that down. And then I guess, um, yeah, I'm just looking to see if I have everything. So I think I do have everything that I need for this. Um, so we need to make a fluid encapsulator. Um, so we need two copper gears. So we can make two of those, I think, right now. Um, so yeah, there we go. Let's make, let's make two of those. So let's go ahead and, uh, I think I need, I think I need one more. I think I need one more, yeah, one more little piece of copper. And then we can make one. So that's one. That's one uh, copper gear right there. So let's go ahead and do that. There we go. One, two, three. And then we just put that in the center. There we go. So now we got a copper gear. And then we need to make another one. So I'm going to go ahead and make another one. So let's make another copper gear. Um, there we go. Okay, we got another. We got another copper there. There we go. Okay, we need uh, two copper gears. Um, and we need one of those redstone, uh, flux coils, and then we need, uh, okay, and then we need a bucket, and then we need a machine frame, which is pretty simple to do, I know how to do that, so, yeah, we're just gonna need some more glass, so let's go ahead and smelt down some more glass, um, cause, yeah, I don't think we have any more glass, I'm pretty sure I used a good amount that I had, um, building the other machines and everything else that we had to build, so, yeah, um, let's see. Do I have any more? No, I don't think I do. Uh, nope. Nope. Negative. Okay, I don't have anything over there. Um, I do have silver, though, so that's good. Um, we might actually need to have that silver, so you never know. You never know. Um, but we do got 10, though. We do got 10, so I just need to, uh, I just need to smelt that down, too. So I guess I could make another furnace and kind of do that. So, yeah, let's make another furnace. Here we go. Uh, because we're going to need multiple furnaces on, on, on here. And actually, actually, no, 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 no. We don't need to make another furnace. Um, we can actually use the redstone furnace. So let's use the redstone furnace this time. So, yeah, let's go to the redstone furnace. Um, yeah, where the fuck did that other... Uh, I, know I, I know I had tin dust. Oh, yeah, here it is. Here it is. Okay, so yeah, there we go. Let's go ahead and smelt that down into the, into, uh, the tin dust. There we go. Um... We shouldn't take a whole lot of power, but there we go. Let's do this. Okay, so we got a couple of things. Ten. Um, we need to make ten gears. In order to make ten gears, I think I know exactly how to do it. Um, let's see. Uh, ten, 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 ten. Where is it? Okay, I'm going to look it up. Okay, so ten gears. Pretty simple. Um, okay, so yeah, we just need to make, I think, one of those. So yeah, we just need like one ten gear. So that's pretty simple to make and i think i already do i already have a 10 gear i already have a 10 gear in my inventory what the fuck what the fuck <laughs> i already got a 10 gear so all i need is the is the sand now or the glass um which i have plenty now so that's good um so yeah i think that's all i need now um to put this machine frame together and then i also need more iron so i'm gonna go ahead and smelt down some more iron um actually i'm gonna use the redstone furnace because the redstone furnace is a lot quicker to do and it just gets it done. It just gets it done. Like, watch this. Look, I'll put seven pieces of iron in there. Watch this. <laughs> watch this. Like, boom, 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 boom. Look at that. It's already spitting out ingots right now. There we go. <laughs> so, yeah, that's one ingot. That's two. And we're going to have three. And then I think I need four. So, yeah, I think I only need, like, four of these. So, there we go. Um, but I'm going to let the rest of that smell because why not? Why not? Um, and then let's go ahead and make this machine frame i think that's what i need to make um for this fluid uh machine okay let's see okay i do need to have that there we go nice um so yeah machine frame and then all we got to do for the fluid encapsulator we just need to make uh this and then boom there we go now we got a fluid encapsulator and the only thing we're missing now is the uh, magma crucible and then we'll have both of those done um made and the only way to make uh i think i know a way to is there a way to make those bricks? I think I'm pretty sure there's a way to make those bricks. Hold on. Um, magma crucible. Oh yeah, the nether bricks are pretty simple to make. They're pretty simple to make. All you gotta do is smelt down netherite. So 
Pretty simple shit. Pretty simple shit. Okay, so let's go ahead and hook up the fluid. Um, let's put the let's actually put both of these machines right here. So we're gonna put the fluid uh, encapsulator here, and then we're gonna put the next one right next to it, which is the magma crucible. Um, so yeah, here we go. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, smelt this down into uh, into nether bricks, and I think we're gonna need about two of them. So I think I'm gonna need another one. Um, because yeah, it, it works kind of like clay does and uh, Per per like four you need you need yeah, you guys understand you guys understand. So yeah, there we go um, So there we go nice. Okay, so we can make a another brick there we go. Let's make uh, Yeah, let's make a few of these and then let's go ahead and just get this magma crucible kind of Started but we might not be able to finish it this episode, but at least we're gonna get a pretty good start on it so um, it's at least good to have a head start on on everything. So it is what it is, but hey, we got we got to we got to so there we go Nice. Okay, so we got four of those Um, looks like the lava is doing pretty good. Um, it's not really it's actually lasting a lot longer than I thought it was um It's a, it's lasting a long time. That's good. Um All right, so there we go. Nice. Okay, so we got the uh, uh magma crucibles so now we just need to make invar ingots which i think i have a little bit of that left um so yeah i do have a little bit of invar left um left over from making the other machine so we need to make uh uh how many invar gears do we need to make uh, i think we only need to make like two i think yeah two invar gears that's all we need to make okay so boom 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 there we go uh boom 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 there we go nice okay so we got two invar gears done um done made and then we got to make a uh redstone flux coil which basically is just like that there we go and then we need to make another machine frame which in order to do that it's pretty simple you just need to make a 10 gear so we just need to make a 10 gear there we go make another 10 gear and then we just got to put all that together and then i think we have this just about um yeah we just need to have a little bit more iron which is pretty simple to do hold on um yeah, let's go ahead and cook the rest of that into, uh, yeah, let's cook the rest of that into, uh, the redstone furnace. There we go. Because we need to have, I think, four in order to do that. So there we go. There we go. We got four pieces of iron. So we should be able to do this now. So let's go ahead and put all the components together. And then we can make ourselves a magma crucible, which, uh, will help us out in the series. And, uh, all the other stuff that we got to do on here that, uh, is technology related. So the only thing we're missing now is glass. Um... Which is, I mean, let's go ahead and make a, let's make a thing of glass. There we go. That should be enough to, uh, make some glass with. There we go. Um, but yeah, I mean, <laughs> I'm happy. I'm happy that this mod pack's actually working now. So yeah, it is what it is. We're going to get into some more stuff on here. This ain't just going to be me fucking around with technology all day. But some of, some of these episodes might be like that, but Hey, it is what it is. So yeah, there we go. Nice. Okay, so we got a magma crucible and we got the fluid uh, transposer done. So yeah, we got we got some more machines made today. That's good. I think I'm gonna call it a day for now. Um, yeah, a lot, a lot of a lot of good stuff. A lot of good stuff. Um, mod packs fixed. Fucking a lot of good news all around. A lot of good news all around. And the only the only downside to using the rest on furnace though is uh it doesn't give you a whole lot of XP when you smell things down. Um, but hey, it is what it is. It is what it is. But it, at least it kind of is a little bit faster than using a conventional furnace on here. So that's good um, to cook things and everything. But it is what it is. So I think I'm gonna call it a day. Um, we did we did a lot today. We did a lot of good shit today. Um, fix the mod pack. Fucking we got we got uh, we got our we got our shit going on on our technology. Um, which is good. Um, so yeah, I think I'm pretty well done with technology for the moment. Um, unless we need to make more of these machines, I don't know. Um, unless we need to make them, we can make them as we go. So, um, uh, for now, I, I think, I think I'm pretty well satisfied with what we got. We got the redstone furnace. We got the, uh, pulverizer here. We got the, uh, magma crucible and the flux and, and the fluid, uh, uh, encapsulator. I think that's what it's called. Um. And, uh, I mean, it's pretty cool. It's, it's cool. So, yeah, we're, we got we got everything done that we needed to get done today. So, I'm happy about that. Um, next episode, I don't know exactly what we're going to be doing on here. But I kind of want to do something a little bit different instead of technology. Because, uh, yeah, we did a lot of technology this episode. I'll go lie. It's, and it's good to do technology. But I want to do something else um, besides technology on here. So, 
Maybe, maybe we'll do, like, maybe a little bit of exploration or something. I don't know. Um, there's a lot of mods to get into in this mod pack. There's a fuck ton of mods to get into. I guess we could, uh, yeah, I don't know. There's a lot of mods in here. There is a lot of mods. Um, vacuum later. What the fuck? Tinker's workbench? What the fuck? Interesting. There's a lot to this. Oh yeah, there's a lot to this mod. Um, I guess we could. I guess we could make one of these. Um, next episode. Um, we can make one of these little uh, rubber things. I don't know. Interesting. That's how you make rubber. Hold on. How do you get a latex? How do you make latex? Oh. Okay, okay. Before I start hurting out on the on, on all the technology shit, um, yeah, we're gonna do something different next episode. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna I'm gonna I honestly don't know what I'm gonna do next for the next episode, but I will figure it out. Um, but yeah, it probably will be something. I think we'll I think we'll do some more farming stuff. I think that's what we should do, cause I know I know we did a lot of technology this episode, but. We haven't really dove into a lot of farming on this mod pack, so I think that's what I'm going to start doing, um, and kind of maybe trying to automate our farm, maybe. I'm going to look up some videos on it and uh, see what see what, see what what we can do on it, but I'm pretty sure there's a good way we can automate it. I'm going to figure out a way to do it, um, but yeah, now that we got power, we should be able to uh, automate some, maybe, I don't know. Um, I, might, I, might, I might experiment with it, I don't know. Um, but it is what it is. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you guys did, go ahead and leave a like down below. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Let's keep around the channel. Let's keep on doing this. Um, and uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna experiment on a new world, on a new creative world, and just to kind of see if there's like a way to automate a farm first, and then I will do another video because I'm gonna bring you guys two videos today. Um, so yeah, next episode that, I, that that we do, I am gonna try to automate our farm and s just to kind of see if we can, uh, because if we can automate it, that would be a that would be a, that would be awesome. But I don't know for sure. I'm not 100% sure on it, so that's why I do want to do a little bit of uh, a little bit of uh, research and uh, experiments into doing that and just to kind of see if it works or not. Um, but yeah, new mod pack. Uh, yeah, it's fixed now, so you guys can now download it. There will be a download link in the description if you guys want to uh, try out this mod pack. You don't necessarily have to, but if you guys want to, go ahead, try it out if you want to. Um, and, and if there's any bugs or anything, let me know. Let me know so I can fix them, because that's what I'm here to do. That's what I'm here to do. I'm here to make sure this mod pack is working. If I got to get rid of a mod to make that happen for it to actually work, then so fucking be it. Um, I'll, I'll replace it with a new mod or whatever. So it is what it is. Anyway, hope you all enjoyed the video. Just motherfucking seeing Chris sign out, and I'll see you guys on the next episode of Minecraft Modded Beyond Wild.